If you guys are looking for the absolute cheapest coins on the internet right now, head on over to my sponsor, AO. EAH.com. They got the cheapest coins on the market. You can get a million for under 50 bucks. Save that money. Make sure to always use code Poodle at checkout to get your additional 3% off. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over the new Gridiron Guardians promo, which essentially, guys, is Mud Heroes. If you guys have been around Madden long enough and you play it every year, you know that Mud Heroes is staple. Staple in Madden. We get it every year. Typically, we get Mud Heroes 1 and 2. This year, they did Gridiron Guardians, which... I like the name change, right? I mean, it's cool, I, I guess, but for a lot of people, they might confuse them and think that it's like the Gridiron Solos, but it's not. It's actually going to be called Gridiron Guardians, which is just um, pretty much Mutt Heroes expanded right now. For any of you guys who watched stream yesterday, they put some players out. People were very upset, including myself. They gave us a champion 92 overall card, like a, I guess like a, a set hero, right? A set champion, and he had an 84 speed at linebacker. That was just, that was just disgusting. Unforgivable, right? So they did actually go ahead and alter a few player stats and speed to make them a bit better. I think their justification for making cards that bad was that we got a super suit chem that only lasts throughout the duration of the promo and it gave you plus ones every stat which doesn't at 84 speed plus one is an 85 which is still horrible but they did go ahead and actually alter that which I am excited about they did change some stuff so we have to go back in see what cards we have to pick up for the squad definitely excited to go through all this guys now before we get into the video if you're new hit that subscribe button turn that on bell give this video a big thumbs up of course and of course if you guys need coins head over to my sponsor the cards that get better so if you guys do want to go ahead and pick up some of these cards use my sponsor coins are super cheap can't go wrong but let's go over to sets take a look at some of the players that we got gridiron guardian sets are live as you guys see we have three subcategories we have champions heroes and exchange let's start with the heroes we have tredavious white and mike evans and if you guys see you can see the pow bam dragon ball z looking card art right there very, very, very Mutt Hero-esque, right? Forrest Buckner, Amar Cooper, Mike Jasicki, Stefan Gilmore, Slow Kamara, and Jamal Adams. I don't know why they'll never get Alvin Kamara cards right. Ever. Ever. Ever right. For our champions, these are our 92 overall players. We have four of them. We have Ramsey, McCaffrey, Rodgers, and Fred Warner. Fred Warner, sadly, it does not look the greatest because still, even with an upgrade to an 84 speed, it's still not the fastest. Aaron Rodgers, pretty good. McCaffrey, pretty good. Ramsey is absolutely insane. Ramsey's like a must-have guy from this promo, actually. So if you guys want to go ahead and do that. And by the way, to complete them, you have to have three 90 overall cards. And if you do this, you get back, I guess, all three. And your choice of three, yeah, you, got, you get three back. Not the three you put in, three of any that you want. So that is pretty cool as well if you want to go ahead and actually build this Ramsey. I like how it says 83 overall Ramsey on there. And you... Oh, God, EA. You get, an, you get the 83 overall Jalen Ramsey if you go ahead and complete this set. That's good. But the only thing um, with this set is that, of course, the 90s aren't that good. There's not that many maybe you'd want. But let's go click into the price them to see how they are. You know, how are they up yet? So it's looking like 250K a piece right now. These probably will come down to around like 150, 200K ask is where I, where I kind of imagine these landing. In which case, it's still a pretty expensive set. We have to, it remains to be seen what goes from what, right? But let's keep it moving. Let's head over to the store, see what packs they got for us, see what they got going for us in this game. So we get a 90 overall Gridiron Guardians player for, for 10 bucks. It's really not bad. It's not bad at all. And is it auctionable? If it is, guys, it's going to be super cheap. That is super... That's not bad. It's random, of course, but that's not bad. Gridiron's Fantasy Pack for 5 bucks. That's I guess that's okay. A bundle, a pack, Gridiron Guardians. That's, not, that's really not bad at all. Um, I honestly kind of recommend you doing that. I mean, think about it. You open up one pack for 10 bucks. You probably get like a low 80 overall lead, but you can get a guaranteed 90 here, which if that is auctionable, I imagine guys, the price is going to start dropping on these cards pretty significantly pretty soon. So I recommend you go and maybe go we'll snipe some out as soon as this video is over. Let's head over to Gridiron Guardians though. Here are the solo sequences. We've got Prologue, Goofballs in the Grocery, and The Showdown. Milestones. At tier two, you get an 82 overall Gridiron Guardians player fantasy pack. At tier four, you get a 90 overall NCAT Gridiron Guardian Fantasy Pack, which is a free one. And then, of course, guys, at tier six, you get an 82 plus. So another chance to get a pretty good one there. Solos look pretty simple. They don't look horrible. I mean, some will probably be more annoying than others, but they are objective based. There's always going to be that one like there's, I saw force three turnovers in the game. It's not that it's not doable, but it makes chewing clock a lot harder because you actually want to force turnovers. Um, if you guys come over to the Gridiron Guardians objective list, you can also go ahead and get another player by actually going ahead and completing stuff i have to go find what the objective list is it's probably under ultimate season if we come over here it's ultimate season and um i hate have you guys realized that it does that sometimes you click on an objective list in here and it completely takes you to something else okay so gridiron guardians if you can go ahead and actually complete all of these objectives 
Um, let's see, if you complete the 15 objectives, you get another 90 overall Gridiron Guardians player, which is auctionable and can be used in sets. You get 22,000 XP and 37,000 coins. It's available to 1014, so you have two weeks from today to go ahead and complete this. Of course, this isn't going to be the easiest thing, as you guys typically know with this stuff. Um, you gotta play the game. You gotta play the game, gotta get some stuff done, play some solo battles, play some head-to-heads, you know, you gotta do a little bit of everything. So just go ahead and go do that. Pretty much if you play the game, you'll get most of it done, though. Uh, just like playing online head to head for the most part solos won't always do it because you actually need head to head wants to do it so let's head on over to the marketplace let's go check out some of these players on the block see what they're going for these 92 overall cards will probably be in the 400k range if i had to imagine maybe 350 at some point because they it can't be too expensive because they are 90 overall 92 overall players um but it does look like they actually are up there in price currently because i don't see them yet i do not see them at all let's go let's filter out by gridiron guardians here i want to say mud here is so bad it's really hard not to all right i don't see any live actually that's interesting so let's go to the 9090 the 1991s and we do check here guys they're going for 238 like i said this should come down because you do get a guaranteed one for 10 bucks again it could be nat and if that's the case it's still a really good value as long as you can pick the one you want but i don't think you can but either way i mean if it's not nat these it's weird i want to believe it's not because if it wasn't Nat, people would be selling them a lot like they'd be they'd be getting spammed in here but it is also early it's only 10 30 so maybe a lot of people don't know yet what i find weird is that there's no 92 is up yet which is just really weird because it's already been like seven minutes and people and this isn't a hard set to do you know it's not like an ltd it's not like dan marino it's just it's just a regular set kind of weird kind of weird that i'm not seeing any of these live yet well maybe the sets are broken but as you guys know guys these players were revealed yesterday you've probably seen some of the stats in these guys um in my opinion the jamal adams is really good the forest buckner is pretty good Tredavious white's decent uh gilmore's decent evans and cooper are a bit slow for my liking but evans has better speed than cooper and alvin kamara is just not usable um amari cooper i don't know why they gave him less speed than mike evans he doesn't really make sense his route running should have at least been all 90s in that case uh the jamal adams is actually pretty good like i said he's usually a pretty good card powered up and chem powered up and strategy card up if you want to say it like that 90 speed gets above 90 hit power pretty high zone good pursuit gets the 90 play rec he will have a pretty good strength for uh you know for what he is six foot one two thirteen 80 jumping that's not great 80 impact blocking though and importantly he does get a 72 block shit i wish that would have been 80 but it is 70 so it's decent the cards overall it's good it's decent for a free card it's not gonna be a bad choice at all i will be making my best players to keep free from this uh from this promo at some point later today so stay tuned for that and then here we go 92 is our ups we got ramsey ramsey's looking like a beast guys 92 overall jalen ramsey 90 speed 90 excel 85 agility 80 jumping 91 play rec 92 man 90 zone 93 press he gets the press zone man and play rec threshold powered up he will have a 91 speed and 91 excel he's six foot one 89 jumping powered up he's a beast he should have some hit power too if you guys come on down his block shed is low, but his hit power is a 78, which will be a 79. And if you have the red strategy card, he will get a 90. I mean, an 80, sorry. This card's actually really, really good. Jalen Ramsey's probably the best card in this entire promo, although Aaron Rodgers isn't a slouch himself. But he does not get Gunslinger, which will hurt him. But he does get 90 throw power, 92 throw short, 90 medium, 90 feet, uh, deep accuracy, 93 throw under pressure, 92 throw on the run, 91 play action. If you can't afford Dan Marino, guys, Aaron Rodgers is probably the next best thing in terms of pure accuracy like he every single throwing stat he has is above 90 so he's going to be a perfect thrower won't miss throws but he will not go ahead and actually get gunslinger which does hurt him right i mean that's that's just part of this that's how this is going to work but he's not bad as, as as a whole the card itself is actually really good it's just a matter of abilities and he either got bought out which is crazy if someone actually just bought him out i'm finding this weird it only takes three players to complete him and i think you get one for free from doing the thing so Oh, one for 10 bucks. It's kind of weird that's not going down more. But guys, that's it for the video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn that noti bell. Give this video a big thumbs up as always. And of course, guys, comment down below. Let me know who's your favorite player from the promo. Make sure to check out today's later videos. Thank you for watching. I'm out. Peace.